Physical observations. Yep. Yeah, ooh, right, yeah. Uh, every car is an underwater car if you're wearing scuba gear. <laughs> That's oh, true. You could just take your car underwater. Yeah, yeah. And, and over would be a good middle name. I lean over. Oh, right, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, and your motorboat <laughs> is very reminiscent of my horse face. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, but you've got the moustache, yeah. um, which would tickle a bit more. Well, exactly. Now I got Although a you headache. could try it out and see how it goes. I don't know. Yeah. I, I, no, probably not. I don't know not. why I did that. No, I don't, I don't know why I'm not. I'm really sure. I think we're all a little bit wiser, though. <laughs> I think we learned something. It's like a special yeah. Emmy episode of the show. We all yes. kind of learned something at the end. <laughs> I love this Jesse Stone character. He's I the do too. cop, the, the, the cop that gets drunk and can't, you know, get his life yeah, together. Yeah, he's right? kind of a mess. Yeah, and, and and he's fun to play because he is. He's got some very weird rules. Yeah, like he thinks it's okay. He lives on a remote point. He's usually alone at, at night, brooding, and thinks if he just has two drinks alone, that's a good rule. Yeah, yeah. probably not a good rule. That's probably why I identify very strongly <laughs> with this. And is there much of you in this guy, uh, Tom? Are you are, yeah, you, are you are you a guy that can't get his life together? No, I, <laughs> yeah, now that you mention it, yeah. I, 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 I don't have that particular rule about right. two drinks alone at night. And I and I don't call my ex-wife every night like that. No, no, so I, I my gonna... wife is actually here and supporting St me. Still your wife? Yeah, she's a big fan. You know really? what she does? Yeah, I mean sometimes um, um, she she stays up a little later than I do. Uh huh. And, and right. sometimes I miss your show. Does she live in a different house? No. All right. <laughs> but I'm often awakened by this this infectious laugh. Right. Um, That's when, me during, laughing during your monologue. <laughs> And yeah. she, 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 and she, she, and it wakes me up, and I don't think it's funny at all. No, so I, don't. I, 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 sure. I don't always like your monologue that night. When I don't, it wakes I don't me always up. like it at but all. Most, ever. Of, most of the time, I love it if I'm really? already awake. Yeah. yeah, well, that's that's comforting yeah. in a way. Where, where do the two of you live in the same house? Do you live in? A, <laughs> you have a ranch, don't you? You live in a I, ranch. I do. I have a ranch in New Zealand. New Zealand? No. All oh, right. I, okay. I, I just. <laughs> I, I just, you just lied then, I right? Just, you just lied. I, I don't want people to go there. Oh, right. So you, you know? have a ranch <coughs> somewhere in the 48 lower states. Well, yeah. yeah. I mean, I'm, I, I'm, I'm not that big a deal, but, but people steal my mail and, and stuff like that. So I really don't want them to come into the bedroom where we right, sleep. Right, right. No, no. So I'm, it's in New well, Zealand. Well, I wasn't actually asking for a, a, yeah. you know, an exact postal address, including yeah. zip. So I'm not, just saying, you know, a, a state would be fine. California. Um, Wyoming. Right, okay. California. No, it's California. All right, all right. <laughs> what are you, uh, what are you... Ventura County. That's all right, as far right, as I'll All right. Well, you don't, then now you named yeah. the county. All oh, right. God. Um, what about, uh, what, what do you keep at your ranch then? Sheep, pigs, hens? <laughs> uh... <laughs> we keep sheep. We got... I don't we like sheep. We have one sheep, sheep who's, who's, yeah. Well, I, I do, but... <laughs> Not that much. It's, uh, it's your ranch. Yeah. <laughs> We, we have actually, it's kind of sad, we have a very old sheep, and, and, and uh, she's the last one of our brood, so we had to borrow a sheep from one of the neighbor ranchers to keep it company till she succumbs. Really? Yeah. Do you know sad. what they call that in Malibu? A sober companion. <laughs> <laughs> so, so um, I, I don't know, she's having a good life, but it's, it might yeah, be yeah. the end of the trail soon. Well, Listen, all this kind of molly coddling, the sheep's not going to... I mean, the other sheep who get wind of this well, is going to be trouble. They don't treat sheep like this where I'm from. It's like, get in there and get well, your wool off. My now. Wife, my, my wife named them. You don't name, don't know, name animals. I you, know. You can. I, we don't eat mutton. That's all right, for right. sure. All I right. mean, um, uh, this is Billy, I think. I get the mix. There's Billy and Lily and... and, and Silly. And, well, Gertie and... <laughs> we had two cows, Gertie and Bertie, but they're dead. There was a cow they called all Bert. Die. Your animals die. Well, that's later. what that's, happens, that's you know. Bad. Yeah, that's no. Sad. Well, try not to get attached because some yeah. of them are delicious. And the. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> so basically what you have then is one old sheep. That's not really a ranch, No, Tom. no, no. no we got about eight horses. Eight horses, all right. Oh, you, um, do you ride horses? Are you yes, I do. Right. I do. Um, right. Not often enough. Right. My daughter rides pretty avidly. Your daughter's I, I doing very well I ride if I'm getting well ready to do a western. Yeah, yeah she jumps, jumps big She's quite famous for it. Yes. She, you know, she's well, doing she's, really... She's, yeah. The last Jumping time Jumping over five feet, which will wow. give her dad a heart attack. Yeah, there you do. that's dangerous. Yes, it is, yeah. but she's good. 
Well, okay. And, and, and the horses are real expensive that can do uh, that, which yeah, is yeah. why I got to keep working. So buy just yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> What about the, uh, oh, no, please, oh, uh, the ranch, yes. uh, you know, that sheep won't look after yeah. itself. I, uh, <laughs> That's a whole new herd of sheep. <laughs> I don't like to encourage sheep. I really don't. I don't like them with their big square yellow teeth and their funny well, eyes. Really uh, have you, when they're babies, they're just really cute. With mint sauce? Yeah. I couldn't agree more. <laughs> and then, and then they, they, they get to be about four months old. Yeah. And they just go ugly. I know. Um, they, they're, they're just adult sheep aren't really very No, uh, adult, adult sheep. It's a good movie, no. though. Have you seen that movie? Adult <laughs> sheep? No, I, I missed that one. Now, listen, the, the last time you were here, I just want to very quickly, because it's kind of a catch-up time for me. The last time you were here, we were talking a little bit because your daughter had started dating. Yeah. And you were a bit nervous uh, about that. Yeah, I you, figured out what to do. What, do you, what do you do? Well, I collect old Winchesters. Uh-huh. Like, <laughs> so I just show the dates my gun collection. <laughs> how, how is that working out? Well. Yeah, I can imagine. <laughs> and I, you know, I just get bigger. I'm 6'4", and I just... You're huge, yeah, what's yeah, that? Yeah, but you, I get bigger when... Do you ever take steroids? No. <laughs> Human growth hormone? I'm clean, man. Yeah. I'm clean. <laughs> ever, uh, ever play baseball? I Obviously not. I play <laughs> No. I... <laughs> <laughs> You'd be the only one. Yeah. yeah. Hey, listen, Tom, thank you for coming in. Jesse Stone, a sea change uh, in stores when? February 29th? In stores February 29th. 20 February 29th. Tom needs more sheep. Go get it. Yeah. Tom Selleck, everybody. We'll be right back. <laughs> Please welcome the wonder that is Tom Selleck, everybody. Tom Yeah. Good to see you, pal. An errant shot. An errant shot, yeah, yeah. right in the... Uh, right well, in it's the... effective, but it's not where you're supposed to aim. No. So. <laughs> it's a classy movie. <laughs> hey, look, it's nice for you to have me on on Friday the 13th. Well, well I, I, as long as you're not afraid yeah, of Friday no, the 13th. And... It's probably to honor my, my slasher movie. You have a slasher movie? Yeah, it's a while ago. What was but, it? Uh, well, it's a beauty. It's called Daughters of Satan. Daughters of Satan. Yeah. yeah oh, I yeah. I was in a motorcycle <laughs> gang called Daughters of Satan. It's uh, actually it's not very good. No, come but on. The, well, the best thing in it, there are five breasts. <laughs> I, are I, they attached to women or are they just yeah, kind of ghostly? But, no, it's not that. Oh, no. <laughs> scared but aroused at the same time. I, I have no idea why there's an odd number. I, I don't know. But y you all should rent it. Yeah. Stop plugging I, yourself so hard, Tom. Well, I get it's nothing for that movie. I, I, really? I, I, no, I couldn't do a very good deal. I was, I was desperate. Ah. Yeah. Are we talking pre-moustache days then? Is that what we're saying? Uh, I don't remember. You know, I, I may have had one. Yeah? Yeah. Do you have a collection or just the one? <laughs> <laughs> Does this ever happen to you when, 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 when you see people, like at the hardware store or somewhere, they tell you what you've been doing? And they tell it to you like you've done something terrible. Like, you were at the hardware store yesterday. Uh, or you were on the freeway. <laughs> and I, I know, but why do they do that? Well, they, they're concerned that you've forgotten. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would, that would be true. That, that, that would be it. Now, the Jesse Stone character, is, uh, that's been going for a while now. That's, yeah, it, it's, as long it's as Magnum, maybe. No, we oh, did okay. 163 hours, but I'll do 163 Jesse Stones. Yeah, no, it's good. We're on five. Okay, five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's... Uh... But, uh, <laughs> thank you. I, I really like playing him because he's a mess. He, he drinks too much, by the way. I'm familiar we, with we that condition. This, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, and... Uh, but he, he doesn't go to get help. He, uh. he, he likes to just... To keep going, yeah. Yeah, well, he doesn't want to stop, but, it, but he's a good guy, and, and the audience seems to root for him, and, and, and this is our fifth one, and then we got... I just finished shooting the sixth one in Halifax, Nova Scotia. Nova Scotia? New Scotland. New Scotland, that's, that's right. for New Scotland. Is it, is it different to old Scotland in any way, or...? Uh... I, ha I haven't been to old Scotland. Um, all right. And Matt... Now, I'm a... I'm a I'm don't judge him, it's Tom Selleck! <laughs> 
<laughs> he doesn't I'm, have to go just because he's here. No. I'm an American now, anyway. I, I, I'm Scottish, you know. Selick? Uh, yeah. Selick a Scottish name? No, no, name, no. Is Selick is, is more English and a little German, but... Uh, oh, yeah, well, that's very Scottish. They're German. all very friendly, but, the English, the Scots, and the Germans. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but Nelly Fife. Nelly Fife? My grandma. Oh, Fife is, is Scottish. Is, name, yeah, right? and that's part of the McDuff clan. The McDuffs? Yeah, we're lowlanders. And that is not, you know, it's not like Highlanders or... That's not derogatory, you know. Low. Are you a lowlander? I am. Not? Yes. Yeah, I'm a lowlander. Yeah. No. Well, they they Does separate. Does it bother you that the other ones just like? No, no. It's a complete myth. No, Highlanders are actually very short people with red hair. That's right. <laughs> I didn't know that because yeah. I haven't. Well, been they've got all that kind of. I am the Highlander. Yeah, played by Christopher Lambert, who is from Belgium. That makes yeah. no sense at all. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm a lowlander. I'm a McDuff. McDuff. Well, McDuffs are they're perfectly acceptable. They were, I think, they were the clan famous for being uh, insurance salesmen. Yes. <laughs> they would come to the battlefields and sell insurance yeah, to all of the they had soldiers. A big valise and paperwork. Yeah, yeah. It was like, hey, how are you feeling today? Yeah. You know, you can't be too careful. They, uh, they had all their paperwork in their sporin. Oh yeah, this, you, know you know the know name of it, the sporin. Yeah, well, I do. It's the clutch. I have one. It, you, it, it, it's <laughs> the purse. It's not what you think. It's it's, it's this thing that it's this. <laughs> Can you help me here? It's no, you're on your own, pal. <laughs> a a Ferguson would never help a McDuff when they do something like that. Well, it, 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 you, you've seen that little thingy, that little pouch <laughs> that hangs down when you're wearing your kilt and, and, and you put stuff in it. Really? Yeah. What do you put in yours then, Jack? I, I kept a, a pen knife in my spore. Ooh. You're pretty dangerous. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> it's, yeah, and then well, there's a... What are you doing a, wearing a, a kilt anyway? You're an American. You've I, never I, even been to I, Scotland. I, Why? Well, because I haven't been to Scotland, so at least I have You put I the kilt on to save yeah. the airfare? What yeah. are you? <laughs> it's, they're really hot in California, but I actually hot. I wore them to an event once, and that was a mistake, because I was sweating bullets, because it, it's yeah. a lot of wool. It is, a lot of wool. Except, you know, underneath. <laughs> you went traditional? I went traditional. Yeah. I, I wore them. I, I wore them on a, a, a another talk show. I won't mention. Uh, no, please, because I, I like them. I, I wore them on Jay Leno because oh, he's Scottish. Oh, I love Jay Leno. You know? Jay, 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 and, Jay, and, Jay. And, and and I wanted to shame him into wearing it, and I'll wear them if you well, do. Jay, sometime. Jay, Jay's mother but was I, Scottish. You know yeah, that. But I went traditional, and you know when I when I when you sit down, I'm not used to that. <laughs> You, in, you I, How did I get into this stuff? I don't know. You kind of turned yourself on and got going. Are you all right now? I'm good now. I'm yeah. good. I'm over, I'm over the spore and I'm over the kill. Because, right, right. you know, I'm an American citizen and we wear pants Congrats. in this country, mister. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm, I'm panted. I can see you yeah. wearing the pants now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. good for you. But, uh, like a regular American. I have the capability. To wear pants? To wear kilts. All right, don't go on about it. <laughs> what about the, uh, the ranch? You still got the ranch? Still got the ranch. Uh, 63 acres and, wow. and uh, animals and everything. What kind of animals? Do you ever get the animals to uh, do sexy things for Valentine's Day? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, it's, it's getting kind of sad because, um, um, you know, we had cows and, and sheep, and, and, and we, we were kind of rookies when we went there. Right. And now, you know, so many years later, they're all getting old, and, you know, some of them have died. And we well, have that's a, the we circle of life, Thomas. The circle of life, you know? We have a From the day cemetery. we arrive on the planet. Um, -na -na, um, -na -na -na. <laughs> no. You know, it's the circle of life. Don't, yeah. you know. No, it's okay. It's yeah. just, where do you put them? You know, because we, have a, we have a little pet cemetery. Oh, we're, oh. we're a little behind. We, we now have a lot of ashes because we just had to put down it. This is, this is sad, my daughter's pony. Oh, oh yeah. God. Dreamy. Oh. And, and we, we, we got the ashes, but we haven't found a spot for it yet. But the ashes, it's huge. <laughs> it, it comes in like a big popcorn tin. Mm. You know, and, and so we have the cemetery. We have uh, uh, Waffles, the bunny is in there. And oh, that's just... Lisa just a, Cheeky Chops oh, and Bil Billy yeah. Bubble Day, the goldfisher. Yeah, yeah. This is hilarious, Tom. I'm Thank really you. enjoying this.
Well, death is, is funny death, stuff. Death is part of the circle of life. I'm a na na hum na 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 I'm a na na hum na 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 Anyway, it's just something you got to confront and uh, that we hadn't really figured out when we... Oh, let's get some animals. Yeah, yeah. No, it's, yeah. it's the heartbreak of yeah. ranching, Tom. Yeah. And thank you for calling it a ranch, even though I, I, I grow avocados. People in California... <laughs> Well, do you some ever, people do you want ever, to call that avocados? a farm, you know, but, yeah. but in avocado, it's more butch than, in California, it's more butch than that. It's, it's a ranch. Yeah. It's an avocado ranch. Avocado ranch, that's right. I don't know why. Do you ever go and punch the avocados? <laughs> no, I, I Anyone pray? ever try to rustle your avocados? <laughs> Maybe when you were wearing your kilt? <laughs> I have. Uh, hey. I, I have on the property. Uh, um, but no, I kind of pray they stay on the tree. Yeah. Uh, because I sell them. Oh. And, and it's hard to make a profit. What, so. Do you have a little stand by the side of the road? No. Right. No, we, I, I don't do that. Because that, that would get a lot of business. Hi, I'm Tom Selleck. You, uh, <laughs> you want to see my avocados? <laughs> and no, I've never put an avocado in my sporin. Right, good. <laughs> I'll bear it in mind, Tom. It's always a yeah. delight to see you. Yes. A lovely Tom Selleck, everybody. We'll be right back. Not when you've got Tom Selleck, everybody! <laughs> Thanks, Tom! Well, see, the dog has issues. <laughs> And, and, and Jesse has issues, and they got right. problems, and and and, uh, and they're working it out. They've never petted each other. Well, hey. Jesse's never petted the dog. But I, I, I was interested when I watched that clip because I thought well, that dog's gonna find a, a finger or no. something. No. You mean like a clue? Yeah, a clue. No, like it's the... just about them and the stick, and, and the dog won't retrieve it. It's good, isn't it? It's a it's a whole new angle on entertainment. Yeah. Well, actually, that's uh, uh, Reggie, played by Joe, the right. dog. Right, right. And people love him. And he's a big part of our People movies. love dogs. Like, that's yeah, true. Do. You've nailed that part of the Thank market you. right there. <laughs> it's good to see Jeff, by the way. What, Jeff Peterson? Yeah. I, 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 well, I did a movie about robots. You, what, you did? Yeah, it was called Runaway. No one saw it. I... I... Um, but... Is, but... That the, wait, is that the movie where the robot, you throw a stick and the robot goes to get it and then no. it just... <laughs> No, that's, that's, that's no remorse. Right, right. Yeah, on Mother's Day. It's yeah. on Mother's Day. Yeah. All oh, right. But um, Jeff Peters, uh, the, my movie was about robots that, that uh, um, they, they stuck a, a, a bad computer chip in them and they started killing people. And I think Jeff was in it. <laughs> Would you? You could never do it like that, could you, Jeff? Chick, please. <laughs> He's... I know. Anyway, I, I'm just trying to plug that movie. You know, the, the, the poor movie, studio that did it. When did you, did you make the robot movie, then? Oh, 1983. <laughs> You're going to have to let it go, Tom. Yeah. I don't Maybe. think people are going to go see but it now. We might get a re-release or something. You know? nah. It's called Runaway. No, maybe if people, if they put the 3D on it. Yeah. If you get it 3D, because that's the only, people only want 3D now. And Joe the dog. Joe the dog. We yeah, could get him in some Stone added now. scenes. Now, yeah. does does Joe, does the dog help you solve crimes in the actual movie? I mean, the guy, no. that can't be the dog's entire involvement. The dog's got to do something else. Well, other he than tries. That. He, he tries very hard to stop Jesse from drinking. Jesse drinks too much, and and J Joe's always looking at him, you know, with that kind of evil eye. And so my character looks at the dog. So the dog's and this codependent. Is great. You'll right, love right, this okay. movie. I look at the dog, and I usually say, "What are you looking at?" And that's that's one of our scenes. Right. It's pretty good, huh? Yeah, it's awesome. Yeah, you got me. <laughs> hey, this is our sixth movie. I know. You know, these, these, I mean, no, but To be fair, and, these movies are good, actually. That's why I'm yeah, always surprised I when I see them on CBS. I'm like, this is good. Well, maybe, but, I, maybe, I, maybe I picked the wrong clip. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. I think you picked the right clip. I should have done the shooting and the finding the clues and stuff like no, that. No, no, it's all right. It's all yeah, fine. All right. How are you doing? I haven't seen you I'm since good. Earth Day, I think, was the last time I saw you. Wasn't it? Oh, yeah. Hey, do, where's your... Where, I saw your Earth Day thing. Yeah. You know, a long time ago when yeah, Earth Day. Earth Day yeah. last week sometime. Yeah, yeah last week sometime. Um, I saw it and I, I, the hand sanitizer. That's. Do you use the hand sanitizer? I do. Could I, I, I keep this in case Cheryl Crow's Actually, ever on the I'm show. Pretty, yeah. 
That's all right. You know, I'm pretty clean, but... No, oh, you want to... If you've been playing with dogs, you probably want yeah. to ask the guy. Yeah. I sometimes... I, I got three dogs, you know. Do you have any dogs in your own life? I have five. We're down to five. Uh, we were up to 13 at one point. That's unlucky. But, yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> what did you, you get 13 dogs? Well, we had puppies. And, oh, but they, okay. But as you know, you know, some of them get old and they move on. And, oh, and yes. some of my, my, my dogs and my wife's dogs have moved on. Right. To Reno? No. <laughs> no, to... to further, little, further away. Little, I get it, get it. Little cans of ashes. Oh, yeah. that's sad. Yeah. Do you have a little uh, dog cemetery on your... Yes, we do. Really? Uh, uh, Mel's in there. He was a golden retriever. Uh-huh. Uh, is... But was I don't know how you talk about dogs when they've gone. Yeah, yeah. no. Well, well, let me ask um, you: Do you believe in the afterlife? For Mel, certainly. Yeah. yeah, yeah. For me, yeah. 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 So it's just going to be you and Mel doing that thing you did with no, that dog? No, because for uh, all eternity, go get the stick. No. Uh, <laughs> Billy Bubble Day and Lisa Cheeky Chops, a couple of goldfish are in there. Oh right, yeah. And you buried um, the goldfish? Yeah, and waffles, waffles and sausage. You buried waffles? Bunny. Yeah. Well, I was. He They're was, not even alive. They're just tasty. Well, he was a rabbit. Oh, uh, Waffles the rabbit. Yeah. And uh, I can't... Uh, there's, other, there's other critters in there, but I, I can't remember. You're a big animal lover, then. I am. Are you a vegetarian? Am. Vegetarian? Yeah. God, no. No. <laughs> How would I live? Well, no, vegetarian. Some, veg some people that really love animals think, yeah. oh, I'm yeah. probably going to be a vegetarian. I mean, I love animals, too, but some of them are just too darn tasty. I started yeah, a vegetarian... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you could do about it. Yeah, it's, you I mean, know, it's, it's nature. I've got teeth. Yeah. They're in the supermarket. You know. <laughs> I, I started a, a, a vegetable garden, but it's derelict because I don't eat many vegetables. Really? Yeah. So it, I just you seem rather go. embarrassed about that. I am. I, I'm supposed to, but I, this has been going on since I was a kid and had to sit in front of my dinner plate and didn't eat my vegetables. Well, what vegetables are we talking about specifically? That you all don't vegetables. Eat? You don't eat any vegetables. Not That's any. disgraceful. You've got to eat I some. Know. That's why I look guilty. If only you were here on Earth Day, because Jeffrey Dean Morgan's oh, yeah. mom was here and she would have told you to eat your vegetables. <laughs> She's back tonight. She's back. She's come back. Oh my God. She could tell you to eat your, wow. you could tell her to eat your vegetables. Wow. Well, I, 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 I just, you know, I'll eat, I'll eat uh, uh, um, tomato sauce and pasta, but I don't like tomatoes. Because have you ever, you, you know, when you slice them open, they're just not finished. You know? <laughs> All that stuff's in them and the, Well, that's the, the juice and goodness. No. No? It's, what is it Well, then? it may be for you, but, but, I mean, after you grind it all up in a, in a, in a blender, it's okay, but not, not that gelatin-like stuff in the seeds. That's the very stuff that keeps the door open later. <laughs> I understand that one. Right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, I feel terrible you don't eat your vegetables, Tom. Well, it's all right. I don't eat as many as I should, so... That's probably I, I... why you're so short and ill exactly. looking. <laughs> but I like meat. We don't eat our pets, so we, we, we had a couple of cows that I thought maybe, oh, we'll raise our own, because we'll raise our own beef, but they got named. Ah, Gertie, yeah. Gertie and Bertie, and then we had Daisy and Buttercup. You can't eat Buttercup. Gertie and Bertie, no, no, no. no. <laughs> and Daisy and Buttercup's worse. You called the cow Daisy Buttercup? My wife and daughter called them. I did not pick those oh, names. What were you going to pick? What name were you going to pick? Then Iron Man Butch. or something? Butch and Ralph. Butch and Ralph? But it didn't, it, I couldn't sell it. Yeah. Anyway, it's been riveting talk to you again, Tom. <laughs> hey, but how about that clip? That, you listen, you see that clip? I, when I saw that, I didn't think at that point the clip was going to be the highlight of the whole damn thing. But I actually. I actually did like the clip. The clip, it was a certain kind of Dadaist quality to that. <laughs> and, uh, man, okay. It was yeah, good. Yeah, no, it's good. Yeah. I like to see that CBS is still doing stuff that isn't just, you know, people looking well, for semen stains six. in Miami. I think something else is fun. This is, this is a, a character-driven film, um, and it, clearly you can see it's about characters. Yeah. Um, and number seven's ready after this one. So you got another one coming out, so, yeah, so you, don't even, you don't even care eight, if this so, one does well, because so the are already done. Exactly, just forget about this awesome. one. Awesome. No, don't, please, don't. Don't Cause, what? Because I want to do number eight. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Will you bring a clip? Yeah. All right. Don't
Tom Selleck, everybody. We'll be right back. It's just like being a talk show host as well, actually. <laughs> Ah, oh, sure, you can learn all you can at talk show college, but you learn how to interview movie stars on the street. <laughs> Please welcome the treasure that is Tom Selleck, everybody. Tom Selleck. Hello, everybody. They love you. Yeah, how about that? Very nice tonight, aren't they? Very nice. Yeah, All right, so now, Pleasure of your start. You're starting to piss me off a little bit. Uh, yeah, that was really nice. And it was probably because of that really funny clip that we showed in the show. <laughs> You know, Pretty funny stuff. Huh? Well, it's a serious show, Tom. Well, There's a that, drama that there. That certainly was. Yeah, a good choice by the producers, don't you think? Well, you know, yes. we wanted to bring it down a little. You know, <laughs> get a little. <clears throat> hey, can, may I say, I've yeah. noticed a slightly different mustache in yeah. this show. Trimmed nope. up a bit. Yeah, tr it's a little more streamlined. Well, it's NYPD, you know, regulations. Really? You, yeah, you, you, you can't Fu Manchu it. <laughs> I never really thought is you there, was, that's not I a verb, is I don't think you can it? say that anymore, actually, now that. <laughs> Well, Fu Manchu's a guy. You can't make him into a verb and cut your mustache with it. Yeah, all right. No, no, yeah, anyway. yeah. Uh, some horse. What? What happened to that horse? That's not the secretariat, I remember. Oh, yeah, the yeah. secretariat? Yeah. yeah. Oh, sure, that's the one, So, Yeah, you must remember. Oh, I think oh. that's the secretariat. See, it was. Yeah. No. Something happened in the breeding. <laughs> well, you breed horses, don't you? Well, I have. I have. It's, it's complicated, but it all boils down, if you know how to do it, to two words. Make Shipped... it whoopee? No. <laughs> Shipped semen. Shipped semen? Yes, yes. I mean, if you think about it right now. Uh, all okay. Over the... <laughs> Well, you may not want a horse that lives next door to be the father. He may live in Yugoslavia, so you ship semen. So right now, all over the world, there are planes flying overhead <laughs> with semen frozen, <laughs> even as we speak. Oh, my. <laughs> it's good to see Jeff still here. Yeah, he's still here. Yeah, yeah. I still have your magnum poster in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's not the one with the shorts. Do you do you uh, do you uh, ship in? Uh, I ship. Well, for I don't, your horses. I, well, well, you you breed horses, right? I don't. No, some you hire people because. Um, oh, that's, it's, a, it's a tricky well, business. Well, yeah, you got to wear. Oh boy, you got to wear this <laughs> big long glove up to here. And, oh, oh. oh, oh. <laughs> it's well, I don't do it. Oh, I mean, right, yeah, but do, the do vet you, does it. Do you, do you, do you watch? <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> you do, don't you? Yeah, no, it's well. a, it, it's, I don't know. You're, any horsey people out there? No, 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 no. Shut up. No. Hey, uh, but you can't have your horses with you if you're shooting this thing in New York. Can you, uh, do you ride your horses up and down New York saying, I'm Tom Selleck, bitch, I can do what I like? <laughs> Now, horses are tough in New York. There's, yeah. there, there's, no, there's no place to take them, but uh, um, I, I, I haven't ridden in New York in decades. Oh. Yeah. What about uh, bed bugs? You got any of them in New York? Oh. Yeah. God, they're ugly, aren't they? I've they're... never seen any. We're, this is L.A. We, all we have here well, is surfers. I, I haven't seen them either. It, it... <laughs> they get right out of your bedroom. They're like, dude! Except, 
<laughs> they they do close-ups. You know, obviously the exterminators want to make money, so right. So they show the close-ups of these things. Have you had them in your apartment? Then? No, but there was some guy on TV the other day he's saying your mattress now weighs twice as much as it did four years ago, oh. and between lice and bed bugs and your own sweat, so replace your mattress. But he was selling mattresses. So. <laughs> What you're saying is consider the source, yeah, is what you're saying. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I don't and, know. And there's nothing wrong with calling that a mouth organ. That's the term I grew up with. Yeah, mouth organ. Do you play the mouth organ? No. Well, <laughs> now's the time to learn. <laughs> no, no. Yeah, I can't play this. What do I do? All right, you take it out and blow. <laughs> okay, here we go. All right, then. Unwrap it. That's it. Slower, slower. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you ready? Yeah. Okay, go. You see, you did it all by yourself. No, but it, I, I'm an a actor. If I was in a movie, yeah. I'd just go... And, and they'd put in real mouth organ music. Are you telling me no, actors no. fake? Ooh la la! Yeah. <laughs> we just pretend. Were you really in Hawaii, man? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> did they did they just paint it in and you were in Burbank or something? No, I was there. I oh, was you were there. in Hawaii. Yeah. Good. Did you ever go back there? Uh, no, you know I I I, I kind of miss it, but I had this house and then I had to sell the house and 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 because I missed it and I wasn't yeah. getting over there. So so Man, Hawaii is kind of really tough. Uh, it's yeah, so well, bad. There's two, like... there, there, there's two guys over there now and they 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 got, got my old studio so. It's not the oh, the uh, Hawaii Five O. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, of course. Have you been watching that show? No. I have too. <laughs> well, being CBS, part of the CBS, CBS family. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. No, I watch Man, it all. I'm like, oh, okay, I'd love to come out, oh, but I'm watching yeah. the Hawaii Five O. Yeah. With all my favorites. Me too. Yeah. On one of those nights. It, absolutely. <laughs> 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 oh man, we are both going to get. I got him back. Actually, I will. You won't. You, Tom Selleck. Um, That's a beauty. Oh, thanks. Yeah, I know. It's well, uh, yours is bigger than well, mine. Clearly. Actually, uh, <laughs> thank you. Nah, yeah. Yeah. Um, actually, you can call him a blues harp too. A blues harp? Yeah, that no, would be... No, I thought a blues harp was a... No, 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 no that's, a, that's a blues harp, but... And that would be real highfalutin when you get better. I'm sorry. Hey, <laughs> hey, we have to take a break. Will you hang around for another uh, bit? Yeah, I'm All right, then. We're going to take a break. We'll be right back with Tom Selleck, everybody. Tom Selleck. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, no, it's all right. Yes. Uh, welcome back, everybody. Yes. I'm here with Tom. You saw me do this. So yeah, you had a spasm. Yeah. Did you have a spasm? Yeah, it's better now, though. All right. Anyway, do you want me to have a look? Maybe give no, you a little. No, doctor, no. Yeah. <laughs> right, a little bit of a. Yeah. No. And and don't let Jeff do it either. No. Well, no. in your pants. Hey, why? I know. It makes me crazy. Do yeah. you have any... He says, uh, he says that more than any... I watch your show. I'm like, well, no, I watch 5 all the time, too. Oh, right, right. But, yeah. but, um, he says in your pants more than anything else. Yeah, i I, I got to be honest with you. He's got a certain limited vocabulary. Yeah. <laughs> Just ignore him, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> uh, although, it's a little more extensive than I would have it be. Yeah, uh, I understand. But yeah, no, it's a, so tell me about how you're adjusting to living in New York. And I think of you as a country fella, you know. I don't think of you as well, being comfortable in New York. I got my ranch, and, and I'm, I'm commuting a little bit. But I'm in a hotel, you know, and that's with, well, no bed bugs. Right, okay. None whatsoever. Room service? Uh, uh, is it a fat swanky hotel? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. And I'm going to stay there till the money runs out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> New York's crazy. It's and very then, expensive. And then they go, oh, by the way, we're going to tax you. And they add all these taxes to your room, and then and you just kind of pay it. So I'm I'm just in happy land. I mean, can can I ask you a question about uh, yeah. living in a hotel? When you order the porn, yeah. <laughs> how do you keep it away from your bill? Because they say it's not going to appear on your bill, but it does, man. It does. Um, I, I I I don't really know, but I, I I'm told right that it says premium movie. Oh, oh. Well, that, then everybody knows you've just been watching porn, though, isn't it? <laughs> well, 
Well, it, it's kind of like blues harper mouth organ. Ah, uh, well, you know, that's, I've seen it. that one, actually. Yeah. That was a few... Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I, I... This I only saw on a marquee. What? Straight Banana Justice was the best title I've ever Straight seen. Straight Banana Justice? <laughs> I, drove, I drove down a street and I saw that and I just laughed, but probably shouldn't have brought it up on CBS television. No, Tom, you should have brought it up and I'm glad you did. Because I, I, I want to see me that movie, Straight I, Banana I didn't Justice. See I, I didn't go in. No, no, you probably don't. It's, it's not, you shouldn't be, you've got no, a profile, you've got the moustache, you know, the, people yeah. are going to say, yeah. I saw Tom Selleck walking into Straight Banana Justice. No. <laughs> No, they've never said that, and hopefully... No, they no, won't, they, they, uh, they won't, no. So, uh, you're living in New York, and you've got your ranch, and yeah. you had to sell your house in Hawaii. I'm very upset for you. Well, no, it's a good problem. I got, I got two jobs. I got my Jesse Stone movies, and I got... Are you still doing the Jesse yes. Stone, even though you're doing the thing? No, we're doing... We got number sevens on the way, and, and I got Blue Bloods, and I do love the show. It's a good show. It's and, a good and show, that, yeah. That and scene CBS, wasn't supposed to be funny, so... Hmm? The scene wasn't supposed to be funny. No, it wasn't that funny. Well, it's not. It was... <laughs> if you saw the whole show, you'd be crying. Yeah, that's how good it was. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. It's a but, serious show about cops. It's not funny. It's no, not, we not have, everything's we have funny, like, funny, as I know from we the monologue. We have funny stuff. <laughs> 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 we have funny stuff. That, that just wasn't it. Yeah. So I, I, I don't want to... Well, wanna... thanks for bringing that clip, then. That's what well, I'm saying. I... <laughs> I'm not a big time producer on this one. You know, oh. I always bring the dogs. He's doing you bring yeah, the clips of the dogs, it, which are adorable. Yeah, I love which them. you're yeah, very yeah. impressed with. But this was not my choice. But it's it's a good scene when you see the show on Friday nights. Friday nights, yeah. 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 Is that is that you plugging it? Are you plugging it? That was a plug. <laughs> well, it's it's that's my job. You know. No, man, your job is to be Tom Sell. <laughs> And be awesome. Can I ask you a little bit yeah. about this thing here? This yeah. is what is that there? That's imitation elephant hair. So uh, how do you know it's imitation? Because the guy told me it was plastic. <laughs> and it, it was it was free though. Because I was looking at that, I'm thinking that looks like real elephant hair. As yeah. I was looking at it. Well, supposedly with elephant hair bracelets, although they don't usually tie the knots with sterling silver, you know, the each each person who makes an elephant hair bracelet, the uh, yeah, the the bushman. They all have their own knot, and that you can tell who made it. But this is just a fraud. Well, why are you wearing it? Well, it was free. Dude, you have two jobs. You've got money. You can buy yourself. All right. Uh, do you want the box for your organ? Yeah, okay. I do. My <laughs> well, uh, let's be let's be careful and wrap it before you put it in the box. Will you? CBS cares. <laughs> hey, listen, congratulations on Blue Bloods. It's a great show, and, it, and it's a big hit. That, that must be uh, a relief. Well, I keep knocking on wood because we're doing great, and we got renewed for the rest of the year. And, congratulations. Uh, That's awesome. And um, uh, I don't know. I just like the guys, and I like the actors, and I just love the show. Good. Well, then, uh, more but power thanks to for you. the selfie. Uh, you take it. Uh, go with God. Uh, have all of that. And now, here, look. <laughs> Here's a buck. There you go. <laughs> Top selling, everybody. We're we'll right back. <laughs> well, that's not funny at all. Please welcome Tom Selleck, everybody. Tom Selleck. I know, that was a little serious. <laughs> that, was the word, that was the word, the show was just pumping along, and was like, ah, ah creepy, there, laughy, there, and then... There, there's some funny stuff, but it's, it's a serious show. I got a question for you. Okay. Uh, when I come here, it's really nice, you know, you get giveaways yeah. in your room, and I get this basket. Yeah. But every time I come here, it's got a bar of soap, deodorant, yeah. um, and mouthwash and toothpaste. Yeah. Am I the only You're guy the only one that gets it? all of that. Everyone else. <laughs> no, really? They give that I got SSG really? soap, too, by the way. They... I got some. <laughs> wow, they really give away. I didn't know yeah. we give away boardwalks. <laughs> no. 
So. <laughs> is that for yeah, real? Yeah, that's it. Really, mate? Hey, no, you want you want to use that, Tom? That's yeah. that's uh, the ideal mustache oh. washing soap right there. <laughs> Yeah, probably so. I haven't tried it, but it'll get, you know, I guess... Do you wash your moustache separately from the rest of your body or, like, take a separate time of day to uh, do it? My moustache has its own agent. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm not allowed to talk about him, but but I think he does. I mean, uh, the, he has a groomer come in and I we don't you, talk and they, they just, uh, I lay back and they give, that's it. They get stuck in? Yeah. You know, yeah. I sometimes think when I talk to you that if your moustache <laughs> wasn't there, you've got your eyebrows to back it up. Yes, I did. You know, I... I it's almost, it's almost as if you have three moustaches. I do. I do, and then, you know, in Magnum, <laughs> I made the mistake in the credits of what? doing that little eyebrow thing. Yeah, you know? yeah. So every time I take a still picture with, with somebody, they yeah. say, do that eyebrow thing. Yeah. And I say, it's a still picture. Yeah. It doesn't, you know, it, it won't show. And do you ever think now? This a, is my life. No, no, I understand. Do you ever think in a in a powerful scene when you're working as an actor, right? Yeah. And, and you've got a you know a scene like, like a that, powerful scene, right? Like, like that. that powerful scene there, right? And you think I better be careful of how much eyebrow I use here because, <laughs> because they're big, and if you move them too much, pow, you're out of the scene. Well, it and can be if you're lit wrong, you can be like hair, eyebrows, and a mustache, and nobody will see anything else. And yeah. It's a little weird. That's probably how you look here. I would imagine. Yeah. Yeah. This Thanks very... for the nice lighting. <laughs> <laughs> it's the way it is. A yeah. CBS treating you right? Because it'd be nice to know that somebody yeah. was getting something out of them. Does anybody else even get mouthwash? Or no, just... no, nobody. Well, they spent all, all the money on the boardwalk products. soap for you. <laughs> Pretty impressive. Yeah. Are you still riding horses? Are you still? Um... I am riding horses. Yeah. Uh, um, Did you ride a horse much. here today? No, no, <laughs> no, I didn't. Uh, but Secretariat is. I know. Oh, yeah, oh yeah, my you, God. You, uh, Come on, then. <laughs> Who's out at the door? <laughs> I know it's a real horse, but if there were a guy inside, yeah. is the same guy always at the back, or do they switch on? I believe they draw lots. <laughs> also, there's a yeah. competition. They go to the Mexican restaurant at the farmer's market. Yeah. It's not a job you want to get into. No. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. It's a tough area. So how's the Blue Bloods things going? You're playing a cop. Blue Again, Bloods. you're always playing law enforcement well, I guys. Got, I got my Jesse Stone character. Yeah. Uh, which uh, he's a is private on detective, isn't May he? 22nd. Right. My number seven, Innocence Lost. But he's different. You know, Jesse's more of a mess than, than Frank in Blue Bloods. Frank is kind of the patriarch of the New York police commissioner. And yeah. Jesse's just a mess and he lost his job last He's an al alcoholic, yeah. isn't he? Uh, probably so, but yeah. I don't think he's ready to admit it. Yeah, well, that's, see, that's the first step of recovery, apparently. <laughs> So Blue Bloods is going good. I got a commute. I leave uh, um, tomorrow to do some filming. Well, where about us? In New York, because we shoot it there, you know. Oh, really? I'm, I'm like you that. actually make the show in the place where the show is set? Yes. That'll never catch on, no. man. you gotta make it. you got to make it in Toronto. That's where everybody makes well, everything. Well, they said Toronto and sometimes... Look, I, uh, uh, some shows pretend they're someplace else. And I have nothing against it because I like to see my friends work. Yeah, no, that's fine. But, yeah. but we figured New York was good if you're playing the New York City Police Commission. Yeah, well, I, it, it probably I'm helps. I'm old-fashioned. Do, uh, do you enjoy New York City? Do you like uh, I do. and pizza? I do. Yeah, they, um, well, what is, where did I go? Bravo's Pizza, can I say that? Yeah, sure, well, Bravo's Pizza on Boardwalk yeah, Soap, really that's good. the two big sponsors. <laughs> but they call, they, they call them pies there. If you're a real New Yorker, you call it, I want a pie. Well, you can't say that. Yes, you can. No, no, because no, meat, well, you see where I come from, a pie has meat in it. <laughs> Well, there's a lot of things that are flipped around. Where yeah, that's right. Yeah, Pies have meat in them, say. and you can see you you can't see the word fanny. No, you, you can't. Right, but you but can't you see can the say word fanny. Bum. You can say, but because of fanny, you don't no, want to no, go there. No, you can't say fanny. Woo! That's that would no. be like saying a really rude word. Yeah, but we're not there, so we can say. <laughs> Do they know what we're talking about? <laughs> well, I don't think we can tell them. Well, we can, we could say that. In Britain, a fanny is an area that's near an vice American fanny. Yes, it's yeah. vice versa. Yeah, it's kind of... Am I getting too graphic with the... I just, I just wonder... <laughs> your, your, your sexual status is... How does that work? Do you go, come here, honey, hey. let's... Let's get no, going. It was a, it was an ar articulation that was probably a mistake. Yeah, I know. We probably should uh, cut that out. Yeah. Yeah. I'm we sure can't. We we're live. Oh no. You're all right. So, but so you you live here then? I live here in L.A. I see. I, I still even now think that you live in Hawaii. I know it's stupid. <laughs> 
sounds stupid, but I, every time, I, I just for a moment, no. I was thinking, oh, yeah, you must be coming in. Magnum one. lives in. I know that. And, and he's a fictitious character, even though he's in like. Shut up. <laughs> he's in a hundred countries. Oh, well, he's all over. The, are they going to make a movie of it? I heard a rumor they're going to make a movie of it. Uh, they're having some trouble finding somebody to wear the short. <laughs> would they cast, a, they, yeah, would they cast mean, a young dude to do a... Uh... Well, yeah, they haven't called and they haven't written to me. Oh, man. See, that's wrong. Years, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. I, you know what I'm not going to do? What? You know how they, they, they buy a, a TV thing, and then they spend $100, $100 million on explosions and make fun of it, and then they call you up, the old guy, to be, a, to be, a, in a, yeah. say, be in the movie and we'll give you some money, and that will bless our movie. I'm not going to do that. Okay, no let me way. just... No, wait, no, I'm going to do some no. stupid cameo wait. in a Magnum movie with a guy who can't wear shorts. Wait a minute, wait a minute. How much money are we talking about? Well, you know, if we're talking seven figures, maybe. Yeah, I, my I think mind. I, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So well, if they say, so, so if the budget for the movie is like, let's say, $100 million, right? Oh, more. All right, well, Bigger, $150 million. Because my cut of a cameo is even bigger. Well, that's oh, what I'm, I'm saying. They, they, could give, they could give you $10 million. Yes. Oh, so. So, we've established that you will definitely yeah. not do it. Yes, you will do it for money. Well, I don't want to prostitute myself. What are you talking about? You just did. Uh, $10 million is a, well, that's a, a true, lot yeah. of dough. So, what you're saying is you're not a hooker, you're just an expensive hooker. Yeah. Right, right. Exactly. But, uh, no, I'm not going to do that. Maybe. Well, you didn't I think had, about I it. I hadn't thought of it. Yeah, like, they'll give you a lot of it money. It might be a big, big and movie. It might be a huge movie, and you might like the actor that yeah. they cast as the as the Magnum. And then you might think, oh, come on, I'll, I'll do it. I'm and not going to like the guy they cast as Magnum. <laughs> I, I, I like him. You might. It might be Bieber or something <laughs> like that. Yeah, okay. Uh, You're right. It's a bad idea. What, yeah. what, what maybe? He'd fall over once they put the mustache <laughs> on him. Yeah. He was like, oh. They, they are talking about, for real, Magnum, I don't think it's going to happen, but, but, but three men and a, a, a baby, they're talking about three men and a bride. Pretty good idea. That's not a bad idea, actually. Yeah, yeah and get the, the old guy. Yeah, is Gutenberg I available? Do I don't know. Is Gutenberg available for this? I... The Gutenberg's ready. <laughs> You're right, then. <laughs> Ted Danson's ready, and I'm ready. I and, think that'd be great. And, um, yeah, and I don't have to play a stupid cameo. You play, you, no, you I play, play the, the guy. Real deal. You play the I play guy. Peter Mitchell. Yeah, that's a great idea. Better idea. I, and, and then you could, have, you could have a wacky, kind of creepy Scottish sidekick. Yes. <laughs> you could play the groom. I could play the groom. Of my little baby, who's now 22 years old. And I could old. be the creepy older groom. Yes. <laughs> and you could, you could like, hate me and then punch me and stuff. Yeah. Go back to the action stuff. Yeah. No, that's my good. stock and trade. Yeah, we're out of time, Tom. <laughs> oh, sorry. Mouth organ, awkward pause. You what, what? Mouth <laughs> organ or awkward pause. Oh, mouth organ. But it's, uh, blues harp is a little more polite. It's kind of like Fanny and... Oh, I see what you're yeah. saying. Well, okay. Blues harp or mouth organ? Blues harp. All right. <laughs> Uh, is, careful, I don't want to get lost in there. So no, I don't want to tell you. This, this, this is my second blues harp. Really? Yeah. Did you do it the last time you ran? Yeah, but I want to. Okay, you can. That's all right. But remember, you can win the golden blues harp if you can actually play it. <laughs> Having trouble getting your organ out there, Tom? <laughs> <laughs> it's I, the only reason I have it, so I can say that. I can't. <laughs> I can't play, but let's play something. All right, then. Ready? What? Let's do the, the theme music to the, uh, the end of Three Men and a Bride when, you know, the, everybody finds out they love each other and they've learned something. Get, and you married. I don't get married. Yeah. Stop telling like everybody. Stop telling everybody. I bring you the greatest clips. See, that, that, that wasn't really like a clip, Tom. That was like the entire episode. Yeah, it was a like, great, great story. Very dramatic. It was the, a man, yeah. a horse, and a bottle of whiskey. Yeah, that, that's yeah. all you need for a good story. Uncle Teddy. Uncle Teddy. Well, he's not in the show. He's dead now, but... but. Maybe there could be a spin-off. Uh. Dead Uncle Teddy. 
the drunk hey. horse call. Uh, you know, you know. Last time I talked to you about what I'd call a hygiene basket. Yeah, uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, it's a, it's a, you know, it, the basket's got stuff in it. Well, you've upgraded the soap. Oh I'm yeah, very yeah. What well, the little thing we give out? For well, the, the last one was just really cheap. Cheap soap. Yeah, yeah. We, we and, got, we, and this is the kind you steal from a hotel room. <laughs> talking about I was never there right. and this one looks used and rewrapped by the way does it have a pube on it <laughs> I, I, I don't know why would you deal with soap Tom? Well, I mean I, I'm fascinated that you get this basket and it's got all these hygiene products for breath and deodorant and and toothpaste and soap mm. Maybe somebody's trying to tell you something. Am I the only guy who gets it? No, no. no a lot of the celebrities that come here, are Tom, dirty. are filthy. Yeah. They are. They come. They come straight from their nests, and they. Yeah. They don't clean. Now you're clearly very different. You're, you know, you're a legend. No, you're, and exactly. very clean. And I'm hygienic. Um, yeah, absolutely. Look, you know, hey. hygiene-wise. Yeah. Um, did a little fact. Oh, did okay. you know that that people who get poison oak guys? Yeah. Ninety percent of them get it on their penis. <laughs> well, I mean, figure it out. It's contagious, it spreads. If you spread it, on your how penis. is a guy going to spread it? Uh, I have, have never have, gotten Having on my sex penis. with poison oak? That's insane. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, oh, going for a pee! Going for a pee! Exactly. Going for, of course, going for a pee! So if you got poison oak, it's. But wait, but wait, what about if. Uh, Oh, I see. Yeah, but you, you, you had something that's not. I had shingles. I had shingles. Yeah, yeah I, 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 it's just going away now. It's terrible. Yeah, it and you like had a, it, right? I had it last Christmas, and I, maybe I gave it to you. You maybe did because you were. Maybe we, you were here because well, after the show, remember we left. We had sex yeah. with that poisoned oak, and then. <laughs> Where did you get it? I got it in a like a line. Of yeah, course well, here. they say it always. This is not for sissies, man. No, it's a silly, it's a, oh, silly name. But I, I was. I, it's, it's a terrible my wife. Name. I kept coming. She'd come in the room, and I'd be moaning. You know, yeah, it's just it's really painful. So it it travels usually only on one side. Yeah, yep. Yeah, right, and right, I yeah. had it right around the back. Yeah, yeah, me too. And and they say if it if it continues around, you're you're in big trouble. You like, die. You're gonna kick the bucket. Yeah, you die. If it so. becomes a complete circle, you die. It really. Hurts. It, it's the most painful thing that's ever happened to me, including a motorcycle accident. <laughs> I'm not kidding. I, it was. Oh. I could not believe it, and it just doesn't quit. And it's no. called shingles, so which that, is so awful because it sounds like a crispy it potato like you're a sissy snack. If yeah. You can a what? <laughs> I just like. Would you like a little bowl of shingles? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, I mean, this was your. That was my Christmas present. Yeah, last it was year. all Christmas. I had. Is that, well, did you have it this year though, or last? No, year? no. I and I got vaccinated. Oh. Which you can get. Yeah, I'm going to do that. It doesn't do anything about the shingles, but it's just fun to get back. Yeah, yeah, you know. <laughs> I, I, I find myself going to the doctor more and more yeah. often now as I'm getting older. It's a terrible business. You go in there, you see cameras yeah, going all sorts of places. Yeah, and then you go out to dinner with your guy pals and you all talk about what medication. Like what we're doing right now. Yeah. We're just, we're, yeah. we're actually geezering out. We're sitting here going. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. Are you still riding yeah. horses? That's a youthful uh, pursuit, uh, isn't it? I, I ride horses, take care of the ranch. Um, that's what I did. I was really boring. I came home, didn't get the shingles, and, and just went out, and um, um, Jilly was okay with it. Um, and I just worked the ranch. Yeah. But I got it's a little obsessed. Worked the ranch code? <laughs> yeah. Um, Because, you know, you, you're doing a lot of filming in New York, and, and your wife's yeah. in California, you got to go home so and work I'm, the I'm ranch, kind of, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So, I'm working the ranch. Right. No. And I, I plant, oak. Oh, I collect acorns. I'm, I'm like Johnny Appleseed. Really? You know, Why? I, and I plant native oaks in the ground where I'd like to see a tree, and they come up. So, I nurse this tree for a year. Right. I probably planted it when I had the shingles. You, you can't plant a tree when you have shingles or poison oak grows. That's what happens. And I, I come to look at my oak tree, which is now a nice little bush, and, and it's not there. And well, I you can't up. leave a bush lying around in California. Whoa. You know what it's like in L.A. Someone's going to trim it. But th this, this was bad, and this is how I became obsessed over Christmas. I mean, I went up to where the oak tree was, and there was a hole. And this gopher had pulled the whole little baby native oak tree into the ground. So that bastard. That's when I started. 
That's when you got to go get That's the gun. That's when I got the gopher get, bait. Get the gun. No guns. Go nope. for bait. Poison's for worse for him. Poison? Yeah, I became like Bill Murray in Caddyshack. <laughs> 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 so I, what did you do for Christmas, uh, Tom? Well, I, I killed a lot of gophers. <laughs> And I, Tom, I, when I, Tom I, says killed gophers, he didn't actually kill gophers. No, he did no. kill them. Write your letters to I him, just all right? I, I just wanted him to take the poison back to the little house way down underground and share it. <laughs> I'm sorry, but they You're killed like my gopher oak tree. You're like Stalin. <laughs> yeah, this is terrible. They, they killed my oak tree. Yeah, I know, but I mean, you know, live and let live. Gophers have got to live, you know. I mean, it's the, well, it's they the circle live. of life. They're all over the ring. Crank it. Matata here, <laughs> The circle of life. <laughs> you know, the, the gopher eats the tree, the, 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 I can then the, the goes to the bathroom, the seed comes out, and the tree grows where you didn't plant no, it. No, that's and... birds. Oh, birds. Gophers, oh, yeah, yeah. gophers chew up the seeds, and, and, and they, no, there's nothing left. Really? I will never see a tree there unless I plant another acorn, and of course, there's no gopher there. Now. Yeah, I don't know. Gophers will come back. They're yeah. not that easily. I did, I, you know, Caddyshack's a great movie, mm. but you know what I did? <laughs> I was thinking of that when I was thinking of the gophers. I told the two little kids on Blue Bloods. <laughs> I said, this is the best movie. You got to see Caddyshack. What age are these kids? Four years old. <laughs> and... <laughs> I thought you were going to be in trouble for killing the gophers, but and now you're in real trouble. No. Their, their parents got a little upset. Yeah. I mean, there's all these things that you I can't know. say and do in the movie, and I made a mistake, so. Yeah, that must be confusing for them. No, they're pretty good actors, but they yeah, can't but actors, see Actors, even, you know, mature actors are commonly stupid. Yeah. <laughs> really? Oh, many of them are, yeah. yeah, yeah. But the exception of yourself, of course. Yeah, of yeah course. you know. I mean, of course. you're... Wildly intelligent yeah. plan for gopher elimination. Well, I'm, I'm over the gopher thing. Right. I think I, I think the balance of nature has been restored. They're still yeah. there. Yeah, no, and they're lurking. They're just waiting. Gophers aren't going anywhere. They, you know, yeah. they, it'll be all right though. You know, yeah. Hakuna Matata. Right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It'll be all right. It'll be all right. And we got horses. My daughter's still riding, so we got Are horses. Are you not riding? I ride a little bit, but I'd rather work the ranch. <laughs> And I went to the dermatologist and said, oh, you got shingles. And I went, oh, well, so... Welcome back, everybody. Tom's telling me about shingles. Oh, we're shingles. talking about shingles. No, 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 no yeah. sorry. sorry, sorry. So so you, uh, I, I, yeah, I go to the doctor. I didn't know what they were, you know. And I went, he, gets, he says, oh, you got shingles. And I had a little rash. Right. And I went, oh, okay. Well, what do I do? Put some stuff on it. In about two days, I mean, I was moaning oh, and couldn't sleep. Oh, tell you, yeah. No, I, I didn't... I thought I had pulled a muscle. <laughs> and uh, I went to the doctor and he said, no, you... <laughs> You don't get a rash from pulling a muscle. I don't know why that's funny. It was no, terrible. no, it's a terrible. rash doesn't. It comes from other stuff. Hey, Tom. Hi, Jeff. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know. It's too, so listen, you're filming. Has Jeff it, had the shingles. It looks awesome. like it. I think he died. I think what happened is his shingles went all the way around and they met, yeah. and then poof. <laughs> That, no, they say that's bad. That is, but that'd be no, terrible, no, yeah. Like, if, they, if they meet, that's like, you know, crossing the streams, man. You can't cross <laughs> the streams. Uh, crossing the streams near the poison oak. Whoa. Boy, yeah, boy. yeah. Well, keep your hands. Keep yourself. your hands to yourself. Yeah. It went when camping near poison oak. <laughs> yeah. CBS exactly. Gary. All right, Tom, we're out of time here. Uh, let's, uh, we we got we to gotta finish up, do it properly. What would you like to do? Would you like to do the awkward pause? Would you like to do the, uh, the uh, what's the other one? The uh, mouth organ? Got two of those. Oh, you've got two mouth organs? Yeah, I don't need one. All right, then. Well, you could go for the big cash prize. That's, that's the deal. You want to do that? Well, money? Yeah. 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 What time is it, Shadow Stevens? It's time for the big cash. Tom. It's a very simple thing. This is 50 American dollars in singles acceptable at any strip club in these oh, United States. Earn. All right. No, you got to win them. Right. right. Okay. 50. 50 dollars. You can bucks. kill a lot of gophers with 50 dollars. Oh, yeah. Now, there's uh, a number of ways you can, you, can, uh, you can answer a question. You can answer a true or not true question. That's right. It's true or not true. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got to do that. No, no, there's another way, too. Oh, what? Wait, wait. Well, you could guess what's in my box. 
<laughs> what happens is I imagine a box and then yeah. I imagine something in it, but I don't know what's in it. The only person that knows what's in it is Jeff Peterson. And then you guess, and if you're right, he'll tell you, and then you yeah. win $50. All right. What do you want to do? I want to guess what's in the box. All right. <laughs> All right. Your box. I know, I hear yeah, you. I know. All right. <laughs> Are you thinking? Yeah, yeah. I'm also rubbing my eyebrows. Oh. <laughs> when do I guess? Well, dude, right let away? me do my thing. I'm doing oh, my oh, thing, sorry. man. There's a ritual. Yeah, it's yeah, like I, I got to imagine the box. Well, I, I got to imagine before. a thing in the box. And then Jeff's got to do his ESP thing. He knows what's in the box. Now right. you guess. Do, do your thing. And All I'll, right, then. I'll... All right. I've imagined the box. I've imagined something in the box. It's there. I don't know what it is. Go Autograph picture of Betty White. <laughs> An autographed picture of yes, Betty White? Yes, I know, it's true. <laughs> Jeff, what is in the box? The correct answer is an autographed picture of Betty White. Oh! Selig, everybody, talk to Hey, Tom. All right. Um, that... <laughs> What the hell was that? that? That clip made absolutely no sense. Well, I thought, you know, that, that, that I'd come out and you'd say you brought a clip and I'd set it up. That was really a good clip. No, no, Tom, you've lost your mind. No. That was not a good no, clip at all. What, no. That was an outtake. That was a blooper. It, well, yeah, but if I put it into context, see, we... I didn't have much to do in that scene. I mean, most Blue Blood scenes are incredibly exciting. That isn't one of them. Right. Um, but so we were talking, and the guys asked me about what I'm doing as a producer. So I said, I'm working on pitching this pilot. It's a Western. Does the guy have another job before he has that job? That's no. who works on TV. <laughs> so it's a Western. It's called Frontier Proctologist. It's about, it's about a guy who travels the West in a buckboard wearing very thick rubber gloves going from town to town. And, and the reason it's such a home run. It's a home run? Oh, yeah. Yeah, oh, no, I'm serious. Yeah? Because <laughs> the guy's name is, is, is Willie Prober. Mm-hmm. And, and he, he, he's having a very tough time, so you root for him because his proctology practice isn't going very well because he has very big hands. <laughs> and that's, that's, that's the that's, real what, what, what are you looking for? A 13-episode commitment for this <laughs> junk? Well, I'm gonna, you, you, I'm can't, gonna, you can't have that. Have you seen television lately? Yes. yes. I, know, I, know. I make my own so, terrible contribution. So, so we were... <laughs> Greg Ibarra is in our show. He was in Billy Elliot. And I'm, I'm saying, we need a song for the pitch. Right. And, and, and so we, we came up, uh, Willie Prober is sometimes known as Wild Bill. And so we came up with the ballad of Wild Bill the pro Prober. Yeah. Wild Bill Prober. There is a man with big hands <laughs> who roams the west in search of glands. That's, a, that's as far as we got, but that's a start, man. Something. I'm, I'm going to pitch something. it to HBO or Showtime because then we can have naked people and we can swear. <laughs> you laugh. Here's, no, here, here's laugh. what I'm going to say. I never thought I'd say this to you, but I have to say this. I think you've been on this show a little too much. <laughs> well, all right. I, but I have to tell you this. I'm digging the... Uh, the, uh, the vest? The, yeah, that's good. Yeah. I wore them for a while and then I, then I stopped. Yeah, budget, I, budget. Well, I mean, I, it, it's kind of like I, I wear them on blue bloods and. No, it's it's good. I like it. It's like man spanks. It yeah. pulls it all together. <laughs> and and I stole it. You from stole the show. Well, do you wear that on the show? Well, no, no. This one has lapels on the vest, which is very clean. That's good. That, that, that that's my own take personal it off and... touch affectation. Do you design your own clothes? No. <laughs> But they Just the lapels. The <laughs> I said I don't design my own clothes, but I need lapels yeah. on this. That's what you do. Yeah. 
Yeah, so how was your colonoscopy? Oh, it was great. <laughs> I haven't seen you since. <laughs> no. No, it was great. I mean, was... we had the shingles together. Oh, yeah, that was awful. Uh, not yeah. together, really. That well, would be a little, uh, yeah, a little yeah, all right. Um, we had them separately, uh, close together, and, yeah. and I've had a colonoscopy. Oh, I, I'm going for as many as I can get. Yeah. <laughs> the, the thing they give you, that, that, drug? that drug. Oh, man. I mean, I'm they, like, oh. <laughs> The doctor could say, I'm sorry, we're going to take off your arms and legs. And you go, okay, fine, okay, whatever yeah, you it's say. Fine. Do you know what happened? I actually, I passed out because they had to put me right under with the drug because I was getting the endoscope as well, right? So, like, Ooh. that camera first and then... The, oh, no, that one first and then that one. But, but I, uh, I... So when I came to, my wife was in the recovery room, and this is why I said... I remember saying it, but I came to and I went, hey, it's the summer of love, baby. <laughs> <laughs> now, you I, know I, what? The recovery room was best because there's still some of the drugs effects. And the nurse comes up to me and says, you'll be feeling some gas. It's okay to pass it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's and right. that was great. I mean, because they aren't going to be wet, you know. It, it just, well, I, I, because they, they puff a lot of air in when they got the camera yeah, looking around. But here's the thing. I noticed this, I talked about this, because you've had 24 hours of no eating, plus they puff all this air yeah. in there. So when you do pass gas, it's not like, it, it smells like a rich lady came into the room. That's yeah, what it yeah, is, yeah. right? It's like, it's like, oh, no, that's actually not, is I Oprah actually, here? What happened? I actually pity the people who are too young to have had one. Well, I tell you, if I'd have known, I'd have started getting them about well, I'm 20. I'm back. Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah, my, my five years are up. I'm going back. You go every five years? I asked the doctor if I could get it down every couple of months. He's like, <laughs> yeah. yeah. He says it wouldn't cover, insurance wouldn't cover that. I'm like, who said insurance, doc? I'll just. Yeah. But it's an event. You know, they give you that, they give you that drug that, that makes you forget. It's called Versed. You know? I don't know if they gave me that. I, I kind of remember. Kinda remember. <laughs> I, I kind of remember the monitor in this creepy little passageway, and then they would announce things like, we're going to turn the corner now. And... <laughs> you saw your own yeah, colonoscopy? Yeah, I kind of remember the screen. Wow. Yeah. I don't know if I'm ready for yeah. that. <laughs> I don't, I don't want to see there. It's kind of like a 50s horror film. For you, maybe. For me, it'd be like the Mines of Mordor or something. I... Yours would be all kind of like high tech. <laughs> I guess a lot of medical stuff. Um, yeah, it's all right. It's fine. Secretariat's looking a little psychotic. These uh, really? Days. Yeah. Uh, I know yeah. this is new digs. It's yeah. Pretty neat. Yeah, look. <laughs> but, but, um, it's all right. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. We're, we're, we're out of time. You want some fruit? Yeah, sure. All right. um, I, got a, I got some fruit here. Thank you. Uh, what do you want? Um, well, I, I'm not having that. That's no, not, I don't, I what about one of these? No, I don't want it. Is, no. But... no, an apple's good. You don't know, you know want one of these? Let me see. What the hell is that? <laughs> do you remember now? <laughs> uh, you know, actually, I think what this would be good with is... Hold on. Uh, just to take the curse off of it, sort of. Well, it's like Senior Wences. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So, like, a, it's all right. It's okay. It's all right. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Do you know what that is? You've got it's, avocados. Uh, is, that not, is that an avocado? No, I don't know. Buy mine. Don't buy this. This is horrible. <laughs> no, it's not. It's, uh, it's, it's, a, it's a, a coyote. Yeah, it's one of those unrecognizable fruits that you've never heard of that you, you shouldn't eat. I got an apple, man. Yeah, well, all right. Then God bless America. We got to go. Tom Selleck, you're right, Michael. <laughs> Did I yeah, a new survey came out today that uh, the American cities were the worst traffic, right? And I figured, well, it's got to be New York or L.A., right? Right. No. Wrong. <laughs> worst traffic in the country, according to science? Honolulu, Hawaii. I know. <laughs> so, uh, uh, wiki wiki, hoa aloha. <laughs> it means hurry, beloved companions, in Hawaiian. I, I, know, I, know, I know a little Hawaiian. He's actually over there. Ladies and gentlemen, Tom Selleck, everybody. Tom Selleck. <laughs> I didn't say you could go yet.
He's being punished for stealing the last cookie in the tea room. <laughs> Is that code? Call me. 